now let us start the next chapter construction of triangles in your earlier classes you have learnt how to draw the line segment and how to draw the angle and also you have learnt how to construct the triangle with the given measurements now what are the six elements of the triangle the three sides and the three angles are the six elements of the triangle so but what are the minimum required measurements to construct a triangle so what are the minimum required measurements to construct a triangle actually we need to know the three sides and the three angles but we need not know all the six elements of the triangle but what are the minimum requirement to construct the triangle let us discuss this thing now so a triangle can be constructed with any one of the following conditions if we know the first condition the three sides If you know the three sides of the triangle, or we know the two sides and the included angle. between them so we can construct a triangle if you know the three sides of the triangle or if you know the two sides and the included angle between the two sides or if you know the two angles and the included side between them and the fourth condition the fourth case is the hypotenuse and any adjacent side of the right angle of a right triangle so if you know either the three sides or the two sides on the included angle or the two angles on the included side or the hypotenuse and any adjacent side of the right angle of your right triangle so if you know any with any one of the following conditions we can construct a triangle now let us discuss each condition of the construction of the triangle now let us see the first situation where we can we can construct the triangle that is when construction of a triangle when the measurements of the three sides are given construction of a triangle 
when the measurements of the three sides are given so when the measurements of the three sides are given we have to construct the triangle the this the question is construct triangle pqr such that pq equals to 4 cm qr equals to 5 cm and pr equals to 7 cm so with the following measurements we have to construct the triangle so of the three sides we can take any side as the base so first let us draw the rough sketch of this construction so the three sides are given that pq equals to 4 cm qr equals to 5 cm and pr equals to 7 cm here pq is 4 cm qr is 5 cm and pr is 7 cm so first let us draw the base qr with 5 cm so let us draw a line segment qr five cm now immediately we will write the steps of construction draw a line segment qr equals to 5 cm now as the point p is 4 cm away from the point q then we take q center and 4 cm radius we will draw an arc so with the q center and 4 cm radius let us draw an arc with the q center and 4 cm radius draw an arc now somewhere the point p is somewhere on the arc and at the same time p is also 7 cm away from the point r so then let us take r center and 7 cm radius draw another arc to to cut off the previous arc at p now p is 4 cm away from the point q and 7 cm away from the point r then we will draw the two arcs taking q center 4 cm radius and r center 7 cm radius these two arcs will, will intersect in the point p the third step of construction is with r center and 7 cm radius draw another arc to cut off the previous arc at p now join pq and pr now pq will be 4 cm and pr will be 7 cm
join PQ and PR. Hence the required triangle PQR is constructed.